Shalom everyone, this is Aaron Lipkin from Samaria and Etty will probably kill me uh, because I am i didn't shave myself before doing this video uh, but uh, Etty is known to be a very tolerant and loving person so thank God for that. I just wanted to share with you a, a, a moment that I had uh, just a couple of days ago on Mount Ibal. Uh, I visited Joshua's altar with uh, two friends of ours from Britain and they were really inspired by the uh, site and, and, and you know everything that uh, the whole story about the blessings and the, the curses that are that happen in that site. And uh, as, as, the, as we were walking back to the Jeep, um, I looked at the, at, the, at the ground and I saw something sticking out. And I picked it up and it is a piece of clay. Now, a person, a normal person walking and seeing a, a shrapnel or, sorry, not a shrapnel, but a piece of clay lying on the floor uh, would probably just look at it and continue on. But when you're standing at Joshua's altar, uh, at the place that, that served as a temple for the Israelites for many years during the time of Joshua and the judges, so you pick up that piece of pottery and you look at it and you show it to an archaeologist on WhatsApp and he says, Aaron, this is part of a cooking pot from the early Iron Age period. Guys, this is from the time of Joshua. This, this, this piece of pottery was made 3,500 years ago by my ancestors and it was brought there probably as part of the worshiping and sacrificing ceremonies that happened there. So I don't know how many people in the world can hold a piece of pottery and say, my ancestors did this 3,500 years ago. And for me, that's mind blowing. That is exciting. I want to cry because of this, because of this piece of pottery. Um, anyway, I just wanted to share this moment with you. And I also wanted to invite you to our upcoming online course about the places that the Israelites worshipped God, Bethel, Ibal, uh, the, the Gilgal, Shiloh, and uh, Tel Dan. Uh, this is a, a once-in-a-lifetime online course. I, don't, I haven't seen anything like this anywhere in the world and on the internet. So I really invite you to come and join us. Uh, if you want to register, there's still time. Uh, this, the course starts this Sunday uh, at 1 p.m. Central Time, U.S. And uh, if you can't be there, don't worry. Uh, it's going to be recorded and we will share all the uh, recordings with you uh, on YouTube after the uh, each session. So hope to see you there at BibleLandStudy.com and uh, Shabbat Shalom from Samaria.